Picture this, I'm deep in the trenches of war zone, waiting for my chance to respawn and suddenly I glance over at my rig. But wait, what's this? The Aura RGB lighting on the shroud of my Strix RTX 2080 Ti start to fade. Oh. I couldn't believe it. Here I am about to get my house handed to me by some teenage whiz kid and my gaming setup is letting me down. But fear not my fellow gamers, for I have found a solution to this problem. Stick around and I'll show you how to fix the fading Aura RGB lighting on your graphics card so you can focus on what matters, dominating the virtual battlefield. Let's do this. Hey everyone, it's great to have you on my channel. My name is Alex and I'm beyond excited to share my passion with all of you. Whether you're a diehard gamer, tech enthusiast or just someone looking for entertainment, you've come to the right place. I've got a lot of exciting content for you from unboxings, reviews, tips and tricks for optimizing your gaming setup. So let's drive straight in and get this gaming rig back on track. So, that's our side light fiber optic tubing fitted. I'm really happy with that, it's a nice snug fit, so hopefully that's all good. But before we put this back together, I just wanna show you something. So the reason the light stops traveling down this fiber optic tubing is, I don't know how well you can see that, it actually starts becoming clouded and opaque and stopping the light traveling down. And I've got here just a little, basically an LED light connected to a nine volt battery. So hopefully you can see that. Watch this. If we get our bit of old tubing, you can see the light starts to travel down. But as we get to here, it starts to stop. And if I show you the end, obviously you're not seeing any light there. If we get a piece of our new tubing, look at how much better that is. You can see the light traveling all the way down. And if I show you the end, Look at that, there you go. All right, that's my uh, little experiment over. Let's get this graphics card put back together. Uh, 
Okay, moment of truth. Hey, much better. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome, we've come to the end of the video. But before you go, I'd love to hear about your DIY repair experiences. So drop a comment down below and let me know about your own tech fixes. And if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more content like this. Your support motivates me to create better videos. Well, I hope so. And helps me grow my channel. It also tells YouTube to recommend this video to more people. By subscribing and ringing that bell icon, you'll be the first to know about my latest videos and exciting projects in the works. Thanks for tuning in. I can't wait to see you in the next one. Take care and all the best.